Once you've found the show you want to see, why not click on More Information? Here you may find details about the events, ticket prices, and exciting stuff including special offers and film trailers. Now click on Add to Basket. If there is more than one performance, there is the choice to pick from available days and time before you select Buy Now. For an event or show in the Hawthorne, a seating plan will be displayed. Clicking the plus sign will increase the size of the seating area. Likewise, the minus sign reduces the size of the seats. Booked seats are represented by red boxes. Green means they are available and blue indicates your choice. In the Hawthorne there are two seat bands. The stall seating area is in the front. And the good view seats start from the middle of the auditorium and go back. Choose your ticket type. Pick your seat and then click Order Seats. Your ticket is now in the basket. The notice here is important. It informs you that all online bookings must be completed at least one hour before the event starts. From the basket, you can cancel a ticket, continue your booking, or decide to go to the checkout. Let's continue shopping for the purpose of this guide. You can always come back to your basket by clicking the My Basket tab at the top of the menu. Another place to look for tickets you've booked is in the Personal Basket, just in the left hand column. This is activated once you add a ticket to the basket or find yourself away from the My Basket section. There are different ways to browse for or add an event to your basket, as explained in our guide, 8 ways of booking tickets online. Let's say you also want to book a Zone 18 session in Roller City. One way of doing this is to click on Roller City at Campus West. You are then presented with a list of all the Roller City events. Now select Zone 18. Click on Add to Basket. Select Buy Now. A general admission screen is displayed. A screen such as this always pops up for Roller City sessions, museums, outdoor productions, etc. Because they are events that do not require a seat. Select the number of tickets you want by clicking on the arrow box to increase or reduce the number of tickets. Click Add to Basket. Your basket is now updated. You still have the choice to amend your order. For instance, you can delete an item or add more items before going to the checkout. Let's complete this order. You now need to log in if you have not done so already. And for the first time user, you have to register before using our online booking system. See our guide, How to Create an Account.